what is going on you quality lot, Quality XA here today and today I am bringing you guys a brand new video on Destiny. Now today we are going to be talking about what happened yesterday where Activision was at their, uh, they basically show off their earnings for this year for all of their games um, like Destiny, Call of Duty and as well as their companies that they're associated with, uh, Bungie obviously, Blizzard. And all of that good stuff. It's overall just a little event for them pretty much where they release their earnings, have a little presentation. And uh, yeah, sometimes you find some news from them. They even said uh, some stuff on Call of Duty. But anyways, we are focusing on Destiny. So let's get right into this video. And yeah, here is a little snippet of what they said. The full Destiny sequel in 2017 to broaden the franchise's global reach which, along with follow-on content plans, sets the stage for growth. Now, this is probably not too much to you, but to me, guys, this means everything. This is a huge step forward. You can see, obviously, they are still planning for the sequel to release in 2017, roughly September-November time, to broaden the franchise's global reach. So, Destiny will be available in more countries than what it was this year, and... One of the key points, what I notice here, which along with follow-on content plans, sets the stage for growth. So, follow-on content plans, meaning that they are going to fill this game with content. I expect something how they do it on Overwatch. So, every one to two months, we will get a load of content put into the Destiny, just so we do not get bored, which is absolutely incredible. I also have this little snippet here. More console actually tweeted some quotes out. I missed the stream. But here we have this. Destiny 2 will have a great cinematic story, memorable cast of characters, and be accessible to casual players. Set for a 2017 full release. So, another thing to pick up here is great cinematic story. As you guys know, in Destiny 1, they had great cinematics, but the story was pretty lame. It was hard to follow it on. Uh, you had to pay real in-depth detail to actually sort of figure out what was going on. And we still to this day do not know what the Exo Stranger is, where she's from. It's, the same goes with Xur, the Agent of the Nine. We do not know a lot about the Agents of the Nine. But um, I suppose in Destiny 2 we will find out some more information. Also it says a memorable cast of characters. I'm hoping for more funny characters such as Kaid Six. Um, Eris Morn is a brilliant character as well. Um, you know, they need the brighter characters like the Gunsmith and the Bounty Master. They're kind of boring. Then you've got obviously the Lord Shax, the Lord Saladin. They're all big, broad characters with awesome quotes. They're funny characters and hopefully they can keep that up. And then the last bit, accessible to casual players. Now, this is possibly another big bit what you guys are going to think, oh, it's just more players. To me, this is huge. More casual players is excellent. It means that Destiny 2 will grow. When Destiny 2 grows, there's going to be more sales. More sales equal more content because they have the money to make more content. More content means more microtransactions, which is kind of annoying. But the more money that Bungie gets, the more money they get to use to put content out, which is great for us as players of the game. Uh, obviously, some of the stuff is overpriced, which really sucks. But when we do get them big content releases such as the Taken King and Rise of Iron, it makes Destiny that little bit better than a lot of the other games around at this point in time. And that is why I love Destiny. So yeah, they did release some cool information, but this is all we have for the moment. Hopefully in the few coming weeks, Bungie and Activision can release some more information on Destiny 2, maybe a reveal trailer, or even better. But anyways guys... I'm really hoping for a beta for this Destiny 2 game and it will just be absolutely phenomenal. Anyways guys, as always I do hope you did enjoy. Please do leave a thumbs up if you did. It's much appreciated and as always I cannot wait to see you guys in the next video. Peace out, let's try and smash 100 likes on this video and I hope you enjoyed.